want in to see some whales fuck. Of course, you're just humans and ain't you in love. Well, fucked up animal, right? Just a, a bunch of dudes just teaming up on some female gray whale, something like this. Which is to say something like this. But that is not what they are like. No, 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 no. This song is based on the best pornographic science around, National Geographic. So what's it like to be a male gray whale? It's inspirational because first the whales, they rub and roll. They make sure everything's consensual. They don't compete. They don't act rude. Instead, they check in to see who's in the mood. If you wanna make it with the gray whale, fuck in the ocean way down there. You're gonna have to learn to pass and share. You can't be greedy, no, that ain't fair. Because the gray whale's a very best wingman, yeah, man, the very best wingman around. To go skinny dipping when the gray whale is swimming, it's the best time to be found. Oh, they fucking back to three and you not be mistakenly. wondering a, a very obvious and sort of disturbing question right now. How do we know this? Who's out watching the whales? Fuck! Who's out watching the whales? Fuck! Who paid for the kids' college education? Hanging out watching the whales? Fuck! Guys, guys, there's little audience participation. This is one word. It's only it's one word. One only word. four letters. Who's out watching the whales? Fuck! They couldn't afford full-time care. They're just a dirty marine biologist. They didn't go into consulting or finance like their friends at Cambridge. You know they wanted to dedicate their career to watching whales fuck instead. So when mom began her long, slow decline, they let mom move into the house. What a real good kid, what a real perverted marine biologist. That's who's out. song to the ladies on my right. And isn't that just like science? Okay, we all know that there's a severe gender bias when it comes to science, right? <laughs> and why would whale science be any different? It's not why any would... different. If you were to Google, if you were to Google largest animal penis, <laughs> you discover it's a blue whale. I mean, goddamn, it has a whole Wikipedia page all about it. <laughs> Do you know what happens to your YouTube recommendations after you Google Largest Animal Penis? You don't want to know. Do you know what happens to your you porn recommendations after you Google? Never mind, never mind. <laughs> Admittedly, an impressive penis, seven to nine feet long. You see that photograph there? According to the caption, that's just the tip. However, however, if you were to search for the largest animal vagina, there's no Wikipedia page. There's no answer. Yeah, it's kind of interesting. Kangaroos have three vaginas and two uteruses. But that wasn't what I was looking to find out. And we're not going to let this song have that same imbalance. So we're going to teach you about the lady gray whales. Mm -hmm. You think you know what it's like to be a female gray whale? You have no idea. Uh -uh. This is what it's like. The female always has the upper hand. Whoa. Oh, you thought you knew what it was like to be a female gray whale. <laughs> 
Uh, okay. We didn't get that from a textbook, but it should be in a textbook. Uh -huh. <laughs> this is how it is, guys. Once she displays a willingness to mate, it is multiple partners within the hour. Oh, oh shit. You thought you knew what it was like to be a female in Greenville. Uh-uh. She is a boss <laughs> bitch in control. You thought it was like this? Mm -hmm. You thought it was like this? No. Uh -uh. It's like this. As everybody knows that the gray whale's a switch. Sometimes a boss, sometimes a bitch. I wish that I could have my wish and hang out with some voyeuristic fish. Sure, whale numbers are declining, but you can trust us, we're not lying when I say that the gray whale's trying to make. Mistakenly, 